Oh. Of course the gimbal is malfunctioning again. We are having fun. All right, guys, well. We are live in downtown Clearwater trying to solve the mystery of where are Scientology's buses dropping the Sea Org members when we are outside the superpower building and they're trying to avoid us. But they've got a retired cop on them too. Yeah. Well, the gimbal does not want to behave. All right. So anyway, we did solve the first part of the mystery, which is find a bus. We found the bus. Now it's where does the bus go? Where do the people on the bus get off of the bus? <laughs> so. I don't see any heads in there though. Well, then let's see. Where does the bus pick up the people <laughs> for the bus? Probably call for another bus saying, hey, I got one of them on my tail. The is it just me or is the bus taking evasive maneuvers? The bus is trying to take evasive <laughs> maneuvers. I mean, I don't know this area, but it does seem like he has no I mean, direction. I mean, the guy is literally trying to lose us. <laughs> We're in downtown Clearwater. I mean, this it gets silly at a point. He's, I guarantee you he's on the phone to security to try to get him to come to cut me off or something. You guys, I'm glad I have a, a mount on my dash so I can go live with you guys. I don't know what's wrong with my gimbal, but it's extremely frustrating. I, this guy has just taken us on a wild goose chase around downtown Clearwater. My gimbal is losing its mind. Oh my God, look, we're back. I mean, I mean, by the way, my compadre for the evening is a retired sheriff. So we are being very respectful of all applicable laws. Okay, I'm turning off my gimbal. We just wanna know where the Scientologists are. I have no idea. I don't know what I'm saying. I told you. Yeah. Is he with somebody? Ugh. Right now. Oh, he's pulling back in. He just. No, no, no don't pull in there. I don't was pull say in. say that's private property, correct? Yeah. But go, but go ahead and pull up to the last place we were waiting last time. Okay. Is that behind They can't us? back out of there. No, no, no. Go. Just, oh, do, do another circle around. Oh, my bad. Am I right? Are you right about what? Um, can I, can I you got to go straight. You have to go okay. straight. I wonder if he's just going to pull right back out again. All right. Maybe. Little, um, you can make it right here. Make it right right here. Okay. I'm just going to scoot back around him. In case he's coming right back out. I'm literally just taking my phone off this gimbal Five because it's ridiculous. Is a lot better than his. Is this it? Yeah, make it right here. Yes. Yeah, I just took it off the gimbal, you guys. So I'll do my best. Straight, uh, yeah, past all that. That's a regular bus up ahead, correct? I don't know. Yeah, I think that's one of those trolley kind of buses. Yeah, that's a jolly trolley. Make it right here. what I'm is that not Scientology no that's not Scientology's place and that's just a public bus depot okay I, right I thought it was theirs you right is the bus still there show is and it's absolutely empty and it's off <laughs> they retired the bus that's they funny. retired the bus all right we are on operation find a new bus um or we could just sit here and wait for someone to pick these Sea Org members up Oh, I hear Sierra members coming. Unless they're behind us. We got someone behind There's us? Somebody to our left across oh. the street. It might be what you need. I just want to get a little bit more out of the road. You guys.
Yes. Is this exciting or what? Oh, you've got your streaming as well. Yeah. Excellent. I think I went live before you did. Oh, wowzers. Because I had it ready to go. All I had to do was <sighs> go live. Well, I'll tell you what. How about if I can get I see this headlights. Dag, I see um, headlights in there. What are you talking about? I see headlights. Some, something's coming. On the, the van that you could see through, you know, right at that corner, there were, I saw lights shining on that. Okay. So there's some sort of movement going on in there. Oh, are those the same people earlier who said I told you? Yes. Here, I'll get out. Okay, they're probably watching our stream right now or something. Here, um, da, 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 da. Dum, dum. Oh, I saw lights again. Okay. Hey. I see brake lights. Do you? Hey there. Oh, someone's coming out, huh? Someone's backing out. Okay. Guys, the battery on my gimbal is fully charged. It just, uh... oh, see, that's what they did. They're, they're, they're shuttling people around in little vans. I don't know, I don't know, it's still a mystery. It really is. I'm like, with one hand, with one hand I'm holding my phone, with the other hand I'm trying to manipulate the gimbal. How do I do this? How do I do this? I feel so bad for anyone getting motion sickness looking at the screen right now. Hmm. Oh my God, you guys. Oh, I see. <laughs> you guys, this is redick. Totally ridiculous. Totally and utterly ridiculous. Let's see. See? It doesn't want to do it. It doesn't want to do it. It keeps acting like problem, problem, problem. It's ridiculous. The reason you guys hear um, bus breaks is because we're across the street from the county bus depot. Hey! Oh, nice! Some little bit of shameless self promotion. What? Hold on, let me get my phone off this gimbal because it's screwing everything up. Do you want to be on camera or no? Actually, no. Okay. Music video shot in front of the flag race a couple weeks ago. New single album Oh, sweet! Might be interesting. Is it on YouTube already? Probably tomorrow or sometime this week. Oh, good. Email me a link to it when it's up. Growing up in Scientology at Gmail. Awesome. Nice to meet you. All right, let's say hello to these, to these folks. Hey guys. Oh, what's the puppy's name? Oh, oh my goodness. Hi. I have a Labradoodle. Is this a Golden Doodle or a Labradoodle? Yeah. Oh my goodness, look at you. You are so cute. Hey. How old is he? Oh, he's two years old. Oh, okay. Is he full grown? Oh, yeah, he's yeah. full grown. Oh, wow. Yeah, he's a teen. Good night. Oh, see, it's the staff bus. I'm just gonna walk around to the other side of the building. This is so creepy. Like, it's just like Streets LA says to the security guards on Hollywood Boulevard. He's like, guys, all we're doing is pointing our cameras at you. It's how you choose to behave that gets broadcast to the world. Okay, so check this out. I didn't realize you could get such a clean shot inside the building. 
Wowzers, now I wish my gimbal was working. <gasps> They're like, oh no, there's someone out there. This building, by the way, is where the Sea Org members who work here do all their own courses. It's driving me crazy that the image is so shaky. But I don't know, I guess I'll just show you guys a different angle here in a second. Okay. Yeah, let's see. All Clearwater Police Department officers are authorized representatives to advise any person to leave these premises. Failure to vacate these premises after being so instructed may result in arrest for warning. Trespass after warning. Hi. I haven't found, I haven't seen George. We were trying to follow that bus. I know, I saw that, I was watching you live. <laughs> yeah. So they're taking people out in Sprinter because nothing's going on over there, not even Sprinter bus events. You know what? I wonder if I actually... Can you do me a quick favor? Yeah. And just hold that phone for a second. I wonder if I made the mistake by going live on my phone, holding it the wrong way. Is that even possible? Oh, like a no. Chinese puzzle, like a Rubik's Cube, if you get it Meaning right. I wonder if I was supposed to... <laughs> um, I don't know. I'm going to give it one more shot, you guys. Fuck. Ooh. Ugh. Close your eyes, guys, and if you get motion sickness. <laughs> this is the silliest thing ever. All right. Here we go. Yay! It worked! Praise Zenu! Yay! Just had to get it in there. Okay, so let me show you this awesome angle. I didn't realize you could get such a crystal clear angle into the uh, atrium of the Coachman building from the front. This Coachman building, when I was here training back in the late 90s, it was actually where all the public did their courses. It wasn't where the staff members did their courses. It was where all the public did their courses. And um, yeah. So guys, <laughs> we already went to the motels and couldn't find any out org trainees anywhere. Now we're at the staff college and there's not a Sea Org member to be seen. Well, there was a couple in there. This is unbelievable. So you guys are asking, what is flag? Flag is short for the flag land base. That is the name of the flag land base or the flag service organization is the name of this giant Scientology organization in Clearwater, Florida. It's called flag. The Fort Harrison hotel is part of flag. The superpower building is part of flag. You know what? Can you just tell Lori, I'm going to walk down to the superpower building. Okay. You know what? Let me zoom back out. Bada Bada bing! Hey guys, there's almost 1,400 of you in the live stream right now. Can you do me a favor? Hit that like button. Helps with notifications, apparently. Okay, that's right. You guys were talking about flag. This whole organization in Clearwater, Florida is called Flag. The origin of the name is uh, when L. Ron Hubbard started the C organization. The ship that he was on was called the flagship, and that's where all the best auditor training was done. So that's also where management was. Now, when they came on land and they left the ships, management went to LA, and the auditor training stayed here in Clearwater, or the best auditor training. And so they still call management in LA flag, 
sometimes. And then they call this place here flag as well. So there you go. Here's Scientology's most famous hotel combined with Scientology's largest property on earth. Oh, I see a security guard, uh, his silhouette in the door. How, how cute. How adorable. Let's zoom in on Mr. Security Guard. Hold on. Hi, gotcha. <gasps> He's moving away. He's watching the live stream. He's like, I don't want to be on camera, bruh. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Now, guys, um, I have reviewed the lot dimensions on the Canal, uh, Pinellas County Property Appraiser's Office. And like fully half of this giant foyer is public property. Their private property doesn't start until about right here. And you might be wondering, why is the symbol of the flag land base a giant snow-covered mountain, AKA volcano? And I don't know, could it be because that's where Xenu is locked up in his electronic prison in the Himalayas? Hey, George. It looks like we've taken the whole downtown hostage now. Well, I followed one of the buses out of the back here. Yeah. And interestingly enough, as soon as he realized I was following him, yeah. he started making really evasive turns. He did, right? Just he like went, us. Went completely a different way and ended up back over here at the Osceola. At and the I, Osceola Motel? There's two of them. There's two of them queued up right now waiting for people to come out. Oh, wow. So. Do you want to go back over there? Sure. I'll chill out here. Uh, actually, or do you want me to go with you? They got to be loading up for something soon. What did you want me to do? Yeah, jump in. Okay. Where, where are the uh, they're over there. That's okay. Uh, All right, so they're safe. That's good. Uh, um, yeah, I mean, this guy went down Cleveland, made a couple turns. Did I, you see what the guy did when we were following him? No. It was absolutely insane. He went on like five like minutes of evasive maneuvers in a freaking bus, an empty bus. This was empty as well. Yeah. Is this guy following us? Did that guy just start up his car? Uh, he did. <laughs> that, guy, is that guy following us? Please tell me he's following us. Oh my God, that would make my day. Oh my God, look. Let's see if he flips a Yui. All right, let's keep going. Okay. Uh, so who would be staging at the Osceola? Oh, wait, that's just a motel for public. It's not for staff. Oh, okay. So he's probably just parking there as a decoy. Two buses there. Two buses there. All right, well. Yeah. Let's go say hi. Yeah. If anyone asks us what we're doing at this point, probably to say we're hunting for David Miscavige. The FBI is looking for him. Have they seen him? Do they know where he is? <laughs> Can I check their bag for him? They would like to talk to him. By the way, guys, if you're watching in Clearwater and you want to come down and say hi to us, please feel free. We could use the entertainment and the company. I'm going to have to get rid of this jacket. It's a lot warmer than I thought it was going to be. Well, we'll be over to the Osceola shortly. Okay, that's the bus that they parked earlier. It's still out of commission. I think I saw someone just ask the question, if somebody wanted to join Scientology, where were they going, Clearwater? You can't join Scientology in Clearwater. Actually, uh, you can join Scientology in Bel Air. There's something called the Bel Air Mission. You can join Scientology in downtown Tampa. There's the Tampa Org. And uh, that's pretty much it. Other than that, it's Miami, Orlando. There's not even an org in Tallahassee. There's not even an org in Jacksonville. Even a 
Jehovah's Witnesses packed it up. I mean, you know. Oh, did you get photos of the Jehovah's Witnesses? Were they hanging out next to the Scientology right property? Front, right in front of the bank. Yeah, God, that is funny. Going. God, that is funny. So Here's awesome. all Scientology's empty fake front groups. I mean, is there... I'm trying to see if there's even anyone at the desks. No. No. Nope. Nope to the nope, nope, nope. Damn, sometimes people wonder what will it take for Scientology to leave Clearwater. Guys, I'm telling you, look at the evidence. They've already left. <laughs> <laughs> That's the uh, park that they called Mark, the police on Mark Bunker for sitting down in the on a bench in there when it was empty. Hey guys, we got about 1,600 people watching right now. Hit that like button, please. Uh, people are asking, is this Los Angeles? No, guys, this is downtown Clearwater. I'm gonna be in Los Angeles on Friday. Oh, this is this is their whole this is their staging area. Is this what you meant? Oh, so the Osceola parking lot is actually around the corner. So that yeah, that's where they sort of hang out. But you know what? Maybe that's where we want to hang out. Here, I'll tell you what. Let me get out real quick. Yep. Okay. Ugh. See, this is Scientology's Osceola Religious Retreat. Dun 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 dun. There's still about 900 people watching who haven't hit that like button yet, guys. It's fast, it's easy, it's free. And it does seem to help, believe it or not. I know all the YouTubers say it, smash that like button. But uh, it does actually help. Okay, so this is where the buses hide. At least they haven't turned this one off. But there's only one bus there. And like, what's he waiting for exactly? I don't know. If he would come out, I would ask him. Uh, yeah, I saw the question uh, that you're in Denver. The organization in Denver is a class five organization. Basically, the only higher level organizations in the United States are in Los Angeles and Clearwater. Every other Scientology organization in the U.S., of which there's maybe 75, 50 to 75, are class five organizations, and those are the places where you can get into Scientology. Now, in L.A., there is a handful of class five organizations. You can join in L.A. Hey! Yeah, so it's just the one bus here. That's fine. I mean, Flag is usually running like 10 buses at a time. Well, when I came and got you, there are two of them here, but let's take a shot of the lovely sound from this perspective. Okay, good idea. Um, someone's asking, where is the school that they teach the Sea Org kids? So there actually isn't a school for that anymore because they don't accept kids into the Sea Org anymore until they've finished their GED. Just for liability reasons, they figured that wasn't working out for them too well. So guys, this is the beautiful outdoor concert venue called The Sound. Oh, I guess it's my seatbelt that's not plugged in. Yeah. This is a gorgeous outdoor concert venue, world class. And it's right across the street from Scientology's advanced org called The Sandcastle. And that's why Scientology's having to abandon this building and build a new one. Oh, see, there's a bus. See, those are the buses that are shuttling. Let's wait to see where that bus goes. Okay. So just wait. Here, I'll get out. Uh, uh. Give him a bit of a... I'm gonna shed this jacket. Okay. Hey. All right. Oh, George is going to hit me. See, this is Scientology's advanced organization. This is actually the highest level 
building on the Flagland base. This is where the OT levels are delivered. This is where you learn about Xenu. This is where you practice getting rid of your body phaetons. It's right on the water. It's actually quite, the property itself is quite gorgeous. Guys, the van went in and it never came out. Oh, there it is. The van's underneath the, uh, the overhang. There it is. Okay. So there is a van. It does exist. Someone is getting in it. Let's find out where the van goes. Hi. I think I saw someone ask if it's safe to walk around Clearwater uh, alone. Like, will Scientology try to recruit you? No, guys, it's important for people to understand that you can't join Scientology in Clearwater. Now, the reason why that's important to understand is because it's also why Scientology doesn't want non-Scientologists around downtown Clearwater. Because they don't benefit Scientology. They don't... Uh, hey, maybe these guys want to help us with a, a criminon video. We'll see. Yeah, if Scientology could recruit non-Scientologists here in downtown, then they would want as many as possible. David Miscavige would be opening up all sorts of restaurants and businesses and attractions just to bring people by uh, so that they can be recruited. But that's not what they do. Yeah. You guys want to do a criminon video with us? Oh, okay. You guys Russian? Not Russian? No. From Russia? No. Ukraine? No. Where are you? Hungarian? From Turkey. Turkey! My mother was born in Turkey. <laughs> uh. Constantinople, now known as Istanbul. Can you well. stop to talk to us about my mother? Non-English speaking Scientologist. How common is that down here? Well, she speaks enough English, but... Sure. <laughs> doesn't speak English, but she's being... I actually believe her, because otherwise they would have totally ignored us. Meaning, meaning, if they knew who we were, they wouldn't even have put up with our call you out. silly questions. <laughs> oh, that's what I was saying, guys. Yeah, um, so if Scientology, if you could join Scientology here, Miscavige would literally fund businesses. He would float the cost of the businesses just to keep businesses open to, to give non-Scientologists a reason to come downtown so that body rooters and recruiters and registrars would have fresh meat uh, to deal with. This is why downtown Clearwater looks so creepy. It's why it's so empty. Precisely because you can't join Scientology here. And since Miscavige doesn't see any value in having non-Scientologists around, he would rather they just stay far, far away. That's why he buys up all the buildings and he keeps them empty because uh, he just sees non-Scientologists as a security threat. You know, the more non-Scientologists are around, anybody could be lurking around as a process server waiting to serve him. Things like that. All right, maybe this person will help us with a criminon video. I'm hoping. Let's see. <laughs> hey there. Can you help us with a criminon video? No English? What, Taiwanese? Uh, Japanese. Japanese, okay. All right. Look at us finding out all sorts of interesting stuff tonight. <laughs> all right, there's 1,800 people watching, which means 800 of you haven't hit that like button yet. <laughs> oh, by the way, if you're not subscribed to Clearwater George's channel, uh, it is called Surrounded by Scientology. Go Bucks. Playing right now while we're out here hunting. Are the Bucks playing right now? Yes, oh, I didn't know. I haven't been following the season at all right now. They're in the playoffs. Okay. Um, and hopefully they can beat uh, a team from Philadelphia. So you should have vested interest in both sides. Today. Okay, people in the chat are asking, why am I saying criminon video? 
because Scientologists here at Flag are used to people, are used to seeing other Scientologists shooting little promotional videos. And so I'm asking them, will they help me do a Criminon video? And some of them are going to be like, oh, yeah, yeah, sure, sure, sure. I'm going, okay, good. So Criminon, and also they think I'm a Scientologist, guys. So I'm going to go, so Criminon is our program to salvage criminals in the prison system, right? And they're like, yeah, yeah, of course, of course. And then I'm going to go, so should Danny Masterson be declared an SP for raping all those women or should he be salvaged with the Criminon program? <laughs> and then just see what they say. And then whatever they say, I'm going to go, so what about all the, uh, the OSA staff who covered up his crimes? Should they also be declared or should they be salvaged? Uh, should they be reported to the police and salvaged with, uh, with, wait, no, no, declared or salvaged? To be honest, the question doesn't make sense, but it doesn't really matter. It doesn't, like the second question doesn't make a ton of sense, but it doesn't really matter. Fortunately, the trials did show that there was stuff that uh, was hit, hidden. And yeah. Held back. Yeah. The trial proved that OSA covered up his crimes, silenced his victims, all this kind of stuff. And so, anyway, it, it worked two nights ago. We haven't been able to talk to anybody the last two nights. Uh, oh, come on. Bring your dogs out here for a walk. Can you help us with a criminon video? Look, look, security's coming, running out to keep them away from us. Look, <laughs> guys, you can't make this shit up. Look, look. The security guard just came and got him. The security guard just took him. He was just coming to bring his dogs for a walk. Holy cow. Holy cow. Look, the bus, clearly whoever was waiting for that bus didn't actually have anywhere to go. Well, poor dogs now. They can't come out here and do their thing. Can you help us with a survey? <laughs> <laughs> Guys, you thought I was kidding about, you know, normally you'd have to pull a permit to close a block for a party. All we have to do is show up with a phone. All right, here we go. Let's ask him. All right. This is the hotel. You can check in, but you can't check out, at least not until we leave. Yeah. This is incredible. Hey. Can you help us with a survey? Can you help us with a survey? Criminon? Criminon video. Criminon. Criminon video. Okay. Okay, so Criminon is our program to salvage pris uh, salvage uh, beings in the prison system, right? Can I, before we start? Yeah. Where is it going to go on? YouTube. Oh. You don't like YouTube? Should Danny Masterson be declared for raping all those women, sir? Or should he be allowed to remain in Scientology? Are rapists welcome? All right, we'll catch you next time. <laughs> what would have been a good answer? Clearly YouTube was the wrong answer. I should have said we're, I don't know, we're submitting it to your ethics officer or something. <laughs> All right, there's still about 700 folks who haven't hit that like button yet, guys. Hit that like button. Do us a favor. <laughs> I'm looking at the comments. You guys are hilarious. He was walking like he had a load in his pants. Yeah. Okay, I have never seen this shot as directly as this. So guys, this is Scientology's advanced organization where they do the OT levels and they need silence. And then this is a giant outdoor concert hall. <laughs> right over. You literally couldn't give more of a middle finger to Scientology than building a giant concert hall across the street from their advanced org. And that is why Scientology is having to abandon this advanced org and build, turn it into a hotel and build a new one uh, north of here. And of course, Miscavige will say it's because they, they're expanding. Guys, this is the uh, city of Clearwater owned. This is recently finished just within the last six months. Uh, this beautiful concert hall. George and I saw a Styx concert here last week. 
Uh, George's cousin is one of the founding members of Sticks. What's his name again? Chucky Pinozo. Chucky Pinozo. And his brother Johnny, yeah. And what do you guys call him, Legend? Well, he, yeah, it was his brother, Legend. Oh, his brother was Legend. Got a lot of comments after the last time you mentioned that. Anybody from the South Side of Chicago yeah. will have seen Sticks at their high school dances. Yes. So that's what everybody talks about. Yes, 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 yes. Sure. yes. It was a great show, too. It was a fantastic show. Um... Well, did you like Cartman's version of Come Sail Away better or Styx's version of Come yeah, Sail Yeah, I didn't know that Styx sang Come Sail Away. I thought that was a Cartman special. Is this Lori? Is this Barbara? Uh, no, neither Bar Barbara was going to make it. Oh, okay. She just dropping someone off. Food delivery. What have we got going on? Oh. Can you help us with a Criminon video? Should Danny Masterson be declared for raping all those Scientologists? Or are rapists welcome in Scientology? We'll, we'll wait till you come back. Good talk. Thank you. I want to title my stream, Marked Safe from Being Raped by Danny Masterson. Oh boy. Uh oh. She's like, ah, oh shit. I got to turn around and go back. <laughs> Can you help us with our video? <laughs> mm. Are you from the London org? Oh, yes, quite. Bravo. Uh huh. Let's hear that accent again. Oh, yes, you know. Doodle pip. Oh, look, we got someone else coming out. That sassy girl last night. Does that look like a security guy? No. Oh, we got a Porsche. Should Danny be declared for raping all those women? Oh, just checking. Damn. Sorry. All right, we still got 700 people who could hit that like button, guys. Yeah. You know what? I might as well just stand right here, huh? Let's see. Should Danny be declared for raping all those women? All right. I'll be here when you get back. <laughs> oh. Oh yeah, yeah, this is what I was saying before. Guys, I mean, I've been joking the last few nights that normally you have to pull a permit to close down a street. <laughs> this is a main thoroughfare in downtown Clearwater near a beautiful uh, concert venue down by the bluff on the water. Not a gosh darn diggity dang soul to be seen, Scientologist or non-Scientologist. Don't let Scientology ever get away with saying that they have a a billion dollar annual economic impact on the non-Scientology businesses in this town. Yeah, they do. They don't even have it's a billion negative, dollar impact on their own businesses. It's a negative billion dollar impact. That's <laughs> yeah. the part they left out. Exactly. Let's walk about 50 feet. That's my short body of the marina. Let's yeah, let's do it. Yeah, so this is Scientology's property. We're going to show you how close we are to beautiful water. I mean, even the Scientologists, if there were really a lot of them in clear water, would be down here milling, milling around, having a little late night picnic. Oh, wow, can we go down here? Yeah. She's got this way. Oh. Oh, yeah, you can get around here. Yeah, I mean, guys, look. It's freaking gorgeous. People ask me why I still live in Clearwater. Why should I leave? The Scientologists can leave. By the way, if you're anywhere near downtown Clearwater, come on down and say hi. Oh, yeah, we got, like, a marina and docks and... Where's all the Scientologists just smelling the roses and, you know, 
They've got cool little tour boats that go and drink and watch dolphins and stuff and try and just be thankful that Danny Masters isn't, isn't around, you know. Oh, we got another car coming. Let's see. Maybe they wanna take my survey. Here comes the van. The van's coming. Yes, the van. And we have no idea who's in it. See, that's what happens, guys. We get too far away. Hey, them. Don't worry, man. What's that? <laughs> What's that? Hey. I watch your channel all the time. Oh, no, thanks for coming down. Hey, what's the dog's name? Salty. Salty. Is he friendly? Yeah. Hi, Salty. Oh. oh. <laughs> he probably smells the other two or three dogs that have come out here tonight. So you missed the bus, but you missed the bus, but you found some fans. Yeah, exactly. Did I talk to Yeah. It's great, man. It's freaking great. Thanks for coming out. Absolutely. Yeah, we just, we just wanted to get their thoughts on Danny Masterson, but nobody wants to talk to us. <laughs> oh, that's right. People keep telling me they can't hear anyone I talk to, so I gotta get closer. <laughs> oh my God, he's a killer! No. <laughs> uh, the other dog barked at me the other night too. All right. Well, <laughs> thanks for coming out, guys. Absolutely. Hey, I'm Aaron. Nice to meet you. Shooting a criminal video. Security man chilling at the other entrance. Oh, for real? Yeah, he was in a suit just hanging out back there. Yeah. There you know, it's I, I, it's funny because, like, even if the security guards are there, like, we can't find the Sea Org members tonight. <laughs> we have no idea where they are. We tried to chase, oh, not chase, but follow the buses. They just, as soon as they see us following them, they're, like, taking all sorts of evasive maneuvers downtown. It's really wild. They got you on the clock. They know. Yeah, yeah, they, they know. <laughs> I mean, from any one of these cameras, they can follow us even down to the beach, honestly. You live in Clearwater? Yeah, I live. Well, I lived in Palm Harbor for about ten years, so I, I'm a local. I'm. I didn't actually know anything about Scientology until I started. I got the Liam Remini show, and yeah. then I eventually got on YouTube and saw all your great stuff. So, um, I just wanted. I knew you were streaming. I wanted That's to come cool. say, say hi while I was in town. That's so. great, man. Thanks Are for you coming. College now? Yeah, I go to SPC. So, oh, yeah, nice. yeah. So wait. Uh, yeah, no see problem. your eyes are open. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you guys so much. I just want to say hi. Absolutely. Good to meet oh, you. That's so awesome. <sighs> All right. Okay. Well, this was interesting. Where should we go next? Let's see. Uh, mm, let's think about it because I do want to kind of want to go somewhere else next. I like the fact that we can uh, that we can stream while we're driving. That's just honestly really fun. <laughs> so, what if we just paid the Fort Harrison another visit? Is that do that. that sounds like fun to me? Yeah. Then when the next time you're live, I want to. I want to start down on Keene at Hacienda. Okay. Or at, uh, Sherwood or whatever. Sherwood, and then just kind of show everybody the route here and what we got to deal with with the buses. And, okay. Yeah. That's actually the best way to find the buses is when they're leaving the Hacienda. Um, we'll have to figure that one out. All right. Let's see. Jump in. <laughs> I'm get. I'll get in your passenger. Hi. Hi. Uh oh happening here they oh, yeah, I'm not with those oh okay <laughs> good not? neither are we okay. yeah <laughs> hey, wait, wait if you no 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 I, I won't put you on camera so are you guys one are you guys are you wondering why there's no one on the streets in the whole downtown i was just showing him that it's crazy right yeah. it's because of the scientologist yes i was just showing him that but do you know it's because it could be beautiful because there's so much opportunity here yeah 
So because you actually can't join Scientology here, because this is the highest level organization, because they can't get any benefit from having non-Scientologists around, they do everything they can to keep them away. That's why it's like this. Mm. Yeah. yeah. And plus, bought up a lot of the a lot of the places and stuff. Like yeah, that. and they just leave them empty because they're really, to be honest, there's just not that many Scientologists yeah. here. They just buy all the property to keep people away. They want to isolate. Yeah, exactly. So, but if you ever come down to the show here at the Sound, there's a I'm, amazing. I'm going to look it up because I've never seen the finished product, especially so close, and it's beautiful. The concerts here are amazing. Yeah, and that's the one thing that will actually bring non-Scientologists back down here. Yeah, I'm going to check it out. Are you guys locals? Yeah, yeah. I live like five minutes away. Oh, okay. Yeah. yeah I'm from here too. My, my YouTube channel is called Growing Up in Scientology. Oh. <laughs> I'm, not, I'm, not in, I'm not in anymore, but... I'm, oh, you were a part of it? Uh, born and raised in it. Wow. Yeah, yeah. I was just telling him about like how people's experiences was with leaving the Church of Scientology. Yeah, you'll be surprised what you find. Wow, that's amazing. Well, nice to meet you. And I'm yeah. glad you found your purpose. Yeah. Indeed. So I'm gonna look you up and you'll get a new subscriber. All right, thank you. Thank you. Have a good night, guys. Have a good night. <laughs> okay, so now the test is could you guys hear anything she was saying? Because to me it's crystal clear. I hope you guys can hear it. Ugh. I like how she disclaimed right away. I'm not with them. <laughs> I'm not one of those. <laughs> Okay, they could hear her. Where would you like to go next? Let's um let's hit the FH. All right. Bye, Dave. Uh, we can make it right here. I know I'll get caught in one way up here too far. Yeah, no, we can go through this light and then make a left on whatever the name of that uh, road is on the side of the Fort Harrison. There's Tom Cruise's condo building. Nobody's home. The lights aren't on up there. Although there is a unit for sale on... The seventh floor for a mere $3.4 million. <laughs> Let me tell you something. Whoever decided to list that property at that premium, you're, you're paying the I live next to Tom Cruise premium because ain't no condo down here worth $3.7 million. Unless you're a Scientologist wanting to get near Tom. Yeah. Yeah, we're going to do a concert here at the Capitol some night. That's a good venue. Yeah, Capitol Theater is another little venue that's got nothing to do with Scientology. Although I do now wonder, though, does Moises Sagami own that building? He just might. I don't know, but the, what, it's got the name Billheimer on it. I know. Well, Ruth Eckert Hall, like, controls... Right. It's a Ruth Eckert Hall property, Correct. right? They run Ruth Eckert Hall, Capitol Theater, and The Sound. Yeah. Great music guy. guy is, uh, not a soul on the streets in downtown Clearwater, guys. Not a soul. Make a left here. They were staging a smaller bus, a couple of the white vans there. Some people coming out the side. I'll jump outside. out of the corner, okay. Yep. And then I'll go around the front, make sure everyone's okay. Yeah.
<laughs> the horror that got her inside. The horror. So I'll tell you what I'm actually going to do. I'm going to try something new. I'm going to watch that place from across the street here. That's what I'm going to do. Because honestly, I don't like having their music in my ears the whole night. It's a little annoying. Hmm. Now, believe it or not, Scientology actually pays property taxes on this Fort Harrison hotel. And the reason for that is they're only tax exempt. They're only exempt from property taxes on uh, buildings that serve are being used for a quote unquote religious purpose. And even Scientology can't get away with saying that restaurants and hotels are serving a religious purpose. So, the square footage in their buildings that are dedicated to strictly hotel use and uh, strictly eating, they actually have to pay property tax on that square footage. That's about 20 to 25% of their square footage is hotel and restaurant. Now, the Fort Harrison Hotel, uh, before, before this superpower building was opened, the Fort Harrison Hotel was used partially as a hotel and partially as auditing rooms. And um, when they opened the Superpower Building, they converted the Fort Harrison back to purely hotel use. Anyway, just kind of interesting. Where's all the Scientologists? Okay, and every now and then, just wanna go in and see if we can see them hiding inside. Hey, hey, how you doing? Come out and play. All right, we're having fun. We're having a good time. Chased a couple of vans. Did you? Diagonal. Ten people where? And then across and went in because they didn't want to engage with them. Uh, the one that responded, what, were, what, did, what did they say? Um, I, I, he looked like he was probably a public. And I just said, uh, he parked right after I did. And I said, oh, it's a beautiful night, isn't it? He says, yes, it is. I said, go on a course? He said, yeah. You? <laughs> and I told him, I said, I yeah, uh, probably should, but I'm looking for my friends. <laughs> You should be like, I should, but I'm on an ethics program because Danny Masterson raped me. <laughs> I'm going to use that. Yeah. I will. Or I'm on a sec. I would be on course, but they pulled me out for a sec check because Danny Masterson raped me. And I have to figure out what I did to pull it in. Pull it in. Yeah. It looks like I probably committed that crime in a past life. Exactly. And I'm trying to pin that down. Exactly. I can add it. Hey! What did he say? I have no idea. I think he said Zenu. <laughs> I think he said Zenu. I think he said Zenu. <laughs> so, do you want me to do anything particular tonight? Just go stand by the doors and hang out, or what do you want me to do? I think, I think we're going to wrap it up pretty soon. I just wanted to, I mean, hell, we, we've covered more Scientology properties tonight than we've ever covered before. <laughs> I mean, I think this is the way to do it. 
we have to hunt for the buses. Yes. It's like the hunt for Red October, but yeah. without submarines. Okay. <laughs> and I think we might have to post up or start next time at the Hacienda Gardens where, where, the, where the, the Sea Org members that work here live. Yeah, because there's buses leaving there all the time. Okay. Well, where the heck are they dropping them? I mean, we know when they're not here, they're dropping them over here. We know that. Right. That's where they drop them. But I just... <laughs> so do you know what the building is that's diagonal across from Sandcastle? It's towards this this way. I have to look on a map. Yeah. I'm not, I'm not good with... That's I have where to... there was, I was following a van and then another van pulled out behind me. Yeah. So I was the the creamy center of an Oreo cookie of Scientology vans. <laughs> right. And they both pulled in there and I went around the building to try to watch and they basically were parked midway through that dry area. Yeah. So not 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 Zelda's asking why don't we follow the buses? Not, Zelda, you gotta watch this stream. We followed buses tonight. <laughs> they the buses perform evasive maneuvers and then when they realize we're not gonna leave they just pull into a Scientology parking lot and turn off the bus. And it's still sitting there off. Yeah. yeah. It's crazy. Yeah. And then they just been, they, then they start using the little tiny vans. The Sprinter vans are over there. Yeah. Yeah. And I followed two of those into where they, they pulled in. So yeah. that's exactly what we've been doing. So, uh, oh, wait. We got some people coming here. Oy. Oy. Do you guys want to help us with our video? Do you guys want to help us with our criminal video? No English? No. What, ta Taiwanese? Japanese? Taiwanese. Taiwanese? Oh. Okay. Welcome. Oy. Do you want to help us with our video? Sorry? Do you want to help us with our criminal video? Not right now. Okay, later. Can I ask you? Should Danny be declared for raping all those women, though? No. I, I, I took too long to ask the question. I feel bad now. I, I should have just jumped right on it. So I was going to say, do you want to help us with our video? But then I wouldn't be able to tell if she was a Scientologist or not. So I said, criminon video. And that made her think about it for a second. And then I hesitated. That's on me, guys. I'm going to take the L on that one. I could have jumped right on it. I could have jumped right on that. Uh, and ask the question, but no. All right. All right, guys. Well, we're probably going to wrap it up. We're uh, keeping everyone hostage. All right. Good night. Good night, Dave. Good night, Dave. We'll come back looking for you later. What's that? Let's cut on this way. So I was just walking that direction. Oh, where'd you park? Where'd you park? Okay. Across, I'm across the way, like normal, where we normally park. All right. So anyway, um, there was a lady in a, I think it was a minivan, and her her passenger side window was down, and the doorman comes out of, of the hotel, and I don't think he was speaking English, and said something to her. And then she rolled up her window as I just as I was approaching. So I wave, I waved at her, and she waved back. But I guarantee you, he was telling her, "Roll up your window and don't talk to the person with the phone." Yeah. <laughs> yep. Indeed. Okay. Uh, well, let's just walk back over to the other side of the superpower building. Uh, maybe we'll see if the security gate here is up. Oh, okay, so guys, remember what we learned last night? I already forgot. This is where they can load Sea Org members up in these little vans and then drive them out when they're full. See, so guys, it's, uh, wait. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, there may not be. All right, guys, another, uh, another fun night of 
hunting Sea Org members. Not literally, of course. Just trying to get people's thoughts on Danny Masterson and uh, whether he should be expelled for his crimes against those his fellow Scientologists. And uh, I don't know. It's just hard to find people willing to talk to us. It's almost like they're in a cult and they're not allowed to. Almost. I don't want to go too far. Just want to show you before we wrap it up. This is where all the Sea Org members usually get dropped off all day long. Over and over and over and over and over. <laughs> Buses are coming and going from here all day. Until we show up. This is where we can hold a block party, guys. There's Billy on the street, but then there's AA run on the streets. <laughs> All right, guys. I guess uh, let me flip it around here. Another great night. I guess that's it. Out here with Clearwater George. Subscribe to Clearwater George as surrounded by Scientology. Some great comments. You guys are doing awesome. Thank you. <laughs> All right, guys. Subscribe to Lori Plays at, at Lori Plays Official. And subscribe to Clearwater Cheryl at Feral, Feral Cheryl, Cheryl on the Loose. On the loose. <laughs> wow. That's a lot of words. See you guys yes. tomorrow. Bye.